Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a caselet. It says that Mohit Sharma is checking the stats of his brother Rohit Sharma against different countries who has played against 13 different countries. Okay, so these are the names given and the top scores against these teams, not necessarily in the same order. Now he is telling his friend, uh, giving some hints about the top scores uh, of Rohit Sharma. Okay. So it says that, uh, like if we see this information, the only information that we can direct, it has some condition. It has condition wherein multiple possibilities are uh, possible. His top scores against England and South Africa are consecutive multiples of an integer. So uh, multiple possibilities here as well. Pakistan is one of the countries against whom he has a top score of 137. So we can fill a table like this. Pakistan, we can fill 137. The top score against Bangladesh is less than one-fourth of the top score against UAE, but more than one-third of the top score against Hong Kong, which is more than 130. Okay, so this is a compl bit complicated. But yes, we can do with this statement, okay, because 11 ke multiples, we won't have many. So if, if we talk about the multiples of 11, so if we see this uh, list, we see 209 and 264. Okay, so these are the two multiples of 11 present in the list. And if we talk about the multiples of 19, so we have 57, then we have 114, okay, then uh, 133, 52, 71, 90, 209. Okay, and uh, those are the multiples of 19. Okay, so we have multiple possible cases. But let's fill in information and try to find out that which of these could be. Also, if you read the last statement, it says that the top score against West Indies is half of the top score against some other team. So if we see if any of these numbers is half of any other number, 18 is not half of anything, 23 is not half, 57 is half of 114, okay, 57 is there. Then if we see any other possibility, no. So that is 57. Okay, so this is West Indies is 57 and also we can remove 57 from here. So it will be either 114 or 209. Okay, now this is a crucial thing to figure out. Uh, although there are a lot of values given here and I will tell you how to uh, figure out by hit and run that what could be these pairs. Okay, so there are three pairs of countries for which the sum of his to top scores is equal. So we have to find three pairs of numbers that up add up to the same total, right? Now, uh, it's a hit and trial. There are a lot of possibilities of picking uh, three, uh, like two such numbers and three pairs. So how to deal with it in a simpler way is, see, if we look at the numbers, right? Most of the numbers are like 100 to 162 in this range, okay? So the probability of getting a pair is high in this range. So this is how we solve uh, such kind of questions with a, a proper approach to hit and trial. Don't, hit and trial does not mean that it has to be random. It has to be some probabilistic thing. So if I can say that uh, it is very likely that the sum could be in the range 200 something because most of these numbers are between these range. So there is a high probability that a pair could exist here and the sum will be more than 200. So obviously maybe 250 plus or kind of thing. So let us assume that the sum is 250, around 250 plus, okay? Just uh, a good assumption. So now what we need to do is, we need to pair with the least one or the highest one, okay? So if I pair with the least, you can go either way. You can start from here also or can start from here also. So check 18 if it is pairing with some 200 plus, 18 with 209 is 227. Okay, 227, if you see among the numbers, you won't get any sum 227. Okay, 18 with 264 gives 282. So if you see 282, uh, it is it does not appear. You just have to scan through the numbers. Okay, so it does not appear. So 18 cannot be that a pair. Now, if we see 23 with 209, 23 plus 209 is 232. So 232, just scanning through the numbers, they don't give 232. 23 with 264. 23 plus 264 is 287. Okay, now let us scan through the numbers and bingo, we get a pair. Like 137 plus 150 is 287. We get 23 plus 264 is 
287. So it was a complete hit and trial, but we did in a very systematic way. Okay. So now we figured out that what are the three pairs. So these pairs are 23, 264. Okay, 137 and 150 and another pair is 140 and 147. Okay, all right. Now we are given that uh, the score against England is higher than four of the above countries. So if you look at these six scores, the second highest is 150. So that has to be England. Okay, so England is 150 and England is paired with Ireland. So Ireland will be 137. Okay, so this is done. Okay, uh, next we have filled this, we are yet to figure out these two values, we will come to it later. The top score against New Zealand and Zimbabwe are multiples of 11 in this. Now we know that 264 is one of these countries, okay, it could be Australia, UAE, Afghanistan, South Africa. So 264 cannot come here. So this means 209 will go over New Zealand. So New Zealand it is. 209 okay now 209 is done for new zealand 209 cannot come here so it means for zimbabwe it is going to be 114 okay so we figured out this value so interesting his top scores against england and south africa are consecutive multiples of an integer good point so his top score against england is 150 now, 150 is a factor of 1, 3, 5, uh, then you can say that uh, also of 10 okay, and many more numbers like 15 and all these things. Okay. Now, uh, if you see this, if there are consecutive multiples, so do plus minus 1, 149, 151, nothing of this sort, right? But if we do plus minus 3, we get 147 and 153. So can we have 147 and 150 as one possibility? Also, if we observe 10, then we have 140 and 150. So from this, can we determine that there is a possibility that it could be 147 or 150? Uh, sorry, 147 or 140 because these give you consecutive multiples. This is 49 into 3. This is 50 into 3 consecutive multiples of 3, 14 into 10, 15 into 10, consecutive multiples of uh, 10. So this means South Africa is either 140 or 147. And South Africa is paired with Afghanistan. So Afghanistan will be 147 and 140. By the way, if you are a cricket fan, these are his actual highest scores against different teams. Uh, definitely not uh, the way I have taken uh, in the question, but yes, these are the scores. Okay, so his highest is 264 against Sri Lanka and 209 is against Australia in reality. Okay. All right. So now let's move on to the next information. Okay. So that says ki the top score against Bangladesh is less than one fourth of the top score against UAE. Okay. So we figured out this 140-147 pair also. The third pair left was Australia UAE. That will be this one. Okay. Now it says that the top score against Bangladesh is less than one fourth of the top score against UAE. So this means that if we consider 23, we do not have anything less than one fourth. So this means UAE will have 264 and Australia will have 23. Okay. So this also is filled. Now his top score against Bangladesh is less than one fourth. One fourth of this is 66. So Bangladesh is less than 66. Okay. Uh, then we are given that, but more than one third of the top score against Hong Kong, which is more than 30, 130. Okay, so we have already figured out uh, 264, we have already figured out 209, we have filled these values also. So the only value more than 130 remains is 162. So Hong Kong must be 162 and one third of 162 is 54. So Bangladesh is somewhere between 54 and 66. So between 54 and 50, 66, 57 is ruled out. So it will be 64. So against Bangladesh, his score, top score is 64. Okay. All right. So this is also done. This is also done. We are left with just one value. Okay. So this 114 is also filled. So 18 remains. That is for Sri Lanka. 
Wow, so we are done with this uh, filling of numbers, which initially looked quite difficult, okay, given the type of conditions we had. So one of the questions is against how many countries can we not uniquely determine his top scores? So we cannot determine against two countries, South Africa and Afghanistan. Okay, so that is the answer is two. What is top score against Hong Kong? That is 162. Which is the other country against whom Rohit's top score is 137? That is against, uh, 137 is against Pakistan and Ireland. Pakistan is already given in the statements. Okay, Ireland is the second country. The difference between his top scores against South Africa and Pakistan is, Pakistan is 137, South Africa is 140 or 147. Okay, so now if we read the statements, it says at least 5. No, it can be 3 or it can be 10, right? Not necessarily at least 5. At most 10, yes, it can be maximum 10. So that is our answer. At least 10 is wrong because it can be 3 also. And at most 5 is also wrong because it can be 10 also. So at most 10 is the correct answer. So that is the solution to the set uh, and the answers to the questions. Uh, I hope you must have loved solving this set. So please do let me know in the comments how much time you took to solve this set. And if you enjoyed solving it, don't forget to like the video.